Hey everyone, Nick here, and this video is for anyone involved in hardware who knows how personally frustrating it can be when your welding or soldering doesn't go as planned. Both applications actually require an immense amount of heat, and they aren't without their dangers. For one, you can easily damage any of your hardware, enable some nasty side effects across all of your devices, and worse, start a fire in the wrong hands. Luckily, however, scientists have developed a radical alternative that can bond two pieces of metal together, all at room temperature. Let's check it out. The material is actually a sort of glue that's composed of two different nanorods. And a nanorod is nothing more than a synthesized metal that's sprayed over and over again till it represents the shape of a cylinder. Now, just as an aside, it technically doesn't have to be a cylinder because the dimensions of the rod are totally up to whoever's spraying the metal. Anyways, in this case, both of the nano rods have metallic cores. One is made out of gallium and the other is made out of indium. Both mixtures are kept separate and then one is applied on top of the other. Now here comes the interesting part. Whenever the mixture is applied, the nano rods stand up from their base like bristles on a brush. And whenever you press them together, the nano rods interlock and latch onto each other, almost like a metallic Velcro. Okay, maybe Velcro is actually a bad example because once these things come together, nobody is taking them apart. Once the gallium and the indium coatings react, they create this liquidy film that slips in between the gaps of the nanorods and creates almost like a concrete that holds everything together. It all reacts to create one solid metal junction, and the best part is that all of this can be achieved just by pressing them together at room temperature. You don't have to deal with any of the temperature constraints or evident dangers of techniques like welding or soldering. The glue is both thermally and electrically conductive, which means that it has huge promise for technology, where components are regularly damaged by soldering and other similar techniques. It's also important to mention that the implications for solar tech are huge. Recently, we've been facing big space constraints when it comes to building heat-free solar panels, and now that we have a binding that doesn't require any heating or cooling, we can build tightly packed circuits without fear of the adhesive breaking or the components wearing. Now, unfortunately, the glue still has to be applied in a lab setting for purposes like quality assurance and testing, but nonetheless, it's a huge step forward to finding new practical, better, and creative alternatives to such established electrical techniques. Oftentimes we focus on the bigger picture of huge engineering feats, but we forget that much of those are built upon foundational discoveries like these, and I hope it gets you excited as well. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.